Hi guys and ladies, I need to catch some bass for a new recipe I found online. There are three things I love about this recipe. First, it's low carb. Second, it's easy. And third, it looks delish. <laughs> but I have to pick up these fish and it would be great fun if you could join me. I'm going to start off with this. This bait is called a craw dads. It's made by Z-Man Lures. It's four inches long. I hooked it to this lead-headed jig. It's a 1 15th ounce shrooms. I'm going to have a description of all this stuff in the notes below. I don't know if I rigged it right or not, but let's give it a try. All right, this is exactly the size that I need to call from the lake. Oh, beautiful. I got another one. I got another. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, nice. It's about 12 inches, just maybe a hair under, so I can take him. I think I got one. Yeah, a little guy, very little. <laughs> oh yes, perfect, perfect eating size. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I'm coming. Wow. Woo. Look at that. There's just too many of this size in the lake. <laughs> and that suits me fine. That's good eating material. Big blue kill. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Look at that big lure. He bit. Very nice bluegill. This little thing called a craw dads did a good job. I don't even know if I have it rigged correctly, but it works. Well, I've got five nice fish here, and that should give me well over a pound of fish fillets. I better get in and start filleting them. I can't wait. This recipe, remember, is low carb, easy, and delish. I hope. It was easy fishing yesterday. I got almost a pound and a half of fish fillets. I'm going to cook up only half of that. And it's only because I'm here alone. My frequent guest, the famous restaurant and food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks, well, she's on assignment in Paris reviewing the world's most expensive restaurant, Les Maurice. Well, this gives us a great chance to experiment without fear of failure. Okay, the first order of business, I took this cookie sheet and you see I lined it with heavy duty foil. Now all I'm going to do is spray it with cooking oil. So let's set the oven to 450. Okay, what I have in this casserole dish are just ground up pork rinds. Right there, about a bag and a half, four ounces. Hey, this is low carb, but you could use panko breadcrumbs if you'd like. Now, looky here. Well, this isn't in the recipe, but I know it's good. I'm adding a couple of ounces of freshly grated Parmigiano Reggiano. 
Now, here's about three teaspoons of this Old Bay seasoning. Let's put that in. I'm really making this up. So what I'm doing here is just painting these fillets on one side with mayonnaise. I've got about a half cup here. So I've got our fillets uh, painted up with mayonnaise. I'm gonna take this big one here and dip it right in to our uh, uh, fake breadcrumbs. Now, look at that. <laughs> yeah, now I'm gonna put this over here like this. Go on to the next one. Beautiful. Now I'm painting side two with the mayonnaise. This is better now, this brush. Now my idea is to spoon on the rest of the breadcrumbs on top. I'm not sure how. I think I can do it. Yeah. Yeah, it's working. This is easy. Come on. Easy. Oh. It's like falling off a log. This is going to do it. I'm about done here. Woo! Woo! Okay, let's get these in the oven. I'm going to put our babies in the oven for 15 minutes. Let's see how it comes out. It's been 15 minutes. Let's see how it turned out. Whoa! Wow! Way crispier than I thought. Let's see if it flakes with a fork. Oh yeah, but it's done. It's done. I'm gonna plate them up. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Woo! I'm gonna try our creation. Hmm. This is amazing. Amazingly crunchy. Mm. Oh, wow. Fried fish doesn't get better than this fish. Oven fried. Wow, is this good. I highly recommend this. You know, the test of whether a recipe is good is whether you want to make it again. I really want to make this again. This is delicious. Well, that's a wrap. I'm really grateful that you could join me on the lake and in the kitchen. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you the next time. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm.